Good evening, everybody, and thank you for joining us tonight. Lauren has the evening off. Automobiles getting more advanced, it seems, by the month, and we need more mechanics who could keep up. But the country's seeing a shortage of mechanics, and Hawaii appears to be no exception. Sam Spangler tonight taking a closer look at the issue and a story that's new at 10. The automotive industry is consistently adding more advanced technology into their vehicles. But at the same time, you need more advanced technicians to work on those vehicles. And there's a nationwide shortage of mechanics. In fact, demand is about double that of supply. As more mechanics age and retire, you might have more wait times to get your vehicle service. We're going to lose a lot of shops to attrition. Whether you take your car to a dealership or small shop to get fixed, chances are they're looking for help. Both sides, they, they need workers. You know, dealerships come over here first semester, they're asking for hire people. Robert Silva is a professor at Honolulu Community College's Automotive Technology Program, where he's seen a decrease in enrollment. But that's not the only problem. The enrollment, you know, it's just how much students are coming in. You know, are they even going to go into it after they finish the degree? Because that's a problem too, right? According to the state, Hawaii has had a 33% increase in electric vehicle registration in February opposed to last year. Young thinks the future is scaring some away. If you're a young kid in your 20s and your 30s and you read the paper or look at the television, you look at Tesla and all the electric cars coming out, do you really see a future? Even though it is tougher to learn the math, computer and electronics, Young argues it's a great career with good pay and stability. But that hasn't been enough. You can make sixty, seventy thousand dollars a year, and the kid says, "Are you crazy? I'm not going to work that hard for sixty or seventy thousand dollars." Silva says more needs to be done in getting auto shops and other trades back in schools. They even say elementary and middle school, right? Just getting that interest in students to see what other kind of you know professions you have out there, because you know we have to deal with that stigma that you know automotive. You know, you look at that school. Now, if you or somebody you know is interested in joining the automotive technology program here at HCC, you can head over to our website, KH12.com, for a link. Sam Spangler, KH12 News, working for Hawaii.